Hello and welcome back to Hot of a Boyfriend. Yeah. Yeah, we're doing a part three. Yeah. I like right. birds. We we like birds a lot, and I'm genuinely interested in the story. Um, let's go to math class again because our wisdom's low right now. We gotta get smart oh, well. to keep up with all these big-brained birds. I just find brains. myself wondering what the math we learn is good for. Every person ever. <laughs> Literally. I leveled up! That's gonna cool. bug me now, though. That your wisdom is 11 and not 10. Oh, so sorry. And I'm in my cave because this is where I live. Yep. There's probably a bamboo tree in the plaza this year, too. I think I'll go make a wish. Why do uh, I live in a cave, first of all? I think that's explained. I'm convinced that I live in a world where birds are in control. I said this last time, where I think I'm the last human and it's post-apocalyptic and I live in a cave. Or they just don't have dormitories because they're birds. But, you know, you never know. May, may mother, mother stay healthy this year and may my stomach get better, Ryuta. Oh, I vaguely remember this. You put, like, wishes or something on. Yeah. Yeah. I, I, I'm gonna guess that's San. I think that's San. What should no, I, I wish for? Oh, conquer the world by force. Maybe the birds already Rule did that. Rule the world from the shadows. Or become Illuminati. Be the Illuminati or become a famous artist. Um. There, two of the options are conquering the world or be an artist. I don't know which one to go for. I'm honestly feeling artist is like the right answer, but go for what you want. I want to be Illuminati, kind of. I don't know what's going to change in the game, but... It's kind of neat. with the bad end. I don't know. No, I'm going to do Famous Artists. I'm, I'm too scared to make bad decisions. Because it'll affect me in real life and it'll stress me out. <laughs> oh, that's just... That's your teacher. You should be careful out this late. It can be dangerous for a girl, you know... Why? There's birds. Only birds. What You're are gonna they going to do? I might get pecked while walking home to my cave. Wait, what did you just ask uh, me? If I want to go home to his place? No, no, no. If uh, you want to walk, if he can walk you home. Oh, that's my home. teacher. What if he's the one that pecks me to death? No, thank you. You're good by I don't yourself. Trust... You're not supposed to be alone with a teacher like that. <laughs> I'm going to say no. How do you they live... play video you games? A... You live in a cave and you're going to the arcade. I don't understand this game at all. Today's and an elective day. there's a school and there's nowhere for me to sleep. All right, electives. We're gonna do wisdom again because it's still low. Math. Lots of math. So much math. I'm tired of math. Good Integral home. calculus. No. I'm not prepared to accept this. No. You weren't prepared for such of this moment. Did I level up? Oh, I leveled up again. Oh, how'd your final? <laughs> see, by getting your wisdom up, you you probably did good on your final. All right, we get our final. Oh yeah, because my wisdom was super low. Hey, before. it's my birthday. Sir. Oh, I've gotten better! Alright, cool. Just keep doing math, because that's the only subject that matters. Only math. Success! Alright, last day of the semester. Sometimes it seemed long, and sometimes it seemed short, but either way, it's summer! July 20th. That went by fast. This game time skips a lot. We're already You're at the end of the semester. Club. Today is a closing ceremony, so there are even fewer birds here than usual. Am I the only one? Well, that just makes my job easier. But I'm probably not alone. I've been in this situation before. <laughs> oh. Oh, there he oh. is. Be quiet. I'm the one who works here. Don't tell me to be quiet. Did you want something? Just wanted to be for your friend. Just wondering if you were here. Of course, I'm or always some... here. Aw, he's cute, but now he's kind of a butt. And he's like, just leave me alone. Is it any good? Not really. I'm almost done with it. It forces its safe, ethical viewpoint on the reader, like all assigned reading. What do you like to read? Ah, oh, he's asking what I'm interested in. He's getting to I'm gonna marry you. this bird. You volunteer to work here, so I'm just like birds. <laughs> finally asked about you. Yep. Marriage material. What about... What about... Do you get to pick? Night on the... These are just... Happen. How am I supposed to know what these books even are? You just get YOLO. This one seems like fiction. YOLO. Galactic Railroad. That seems like fiction. That seems too... Okay. <laughs> He's probably yes. read every book in this whole I library. I like it too. <gasps> oh, we have something in common. Back out in my cave. 
Fat and lazy during summer vacation. Hunter gatherer's body is her way of life. So, so maybe, maybe I'll go running today. Okay. So just sleep in your cave all day. I can't. There's like a full city, and then live I live out cave. in a cave. Uh, that, that makes no sense. Bird, apparently, <gasps> birds live in caves. Whoa. So Are that's you just, what happened it's to the just showing a bunch of scenery. What happened to that city? I guess why, you are this, why is this one so nice, but then that larger city was just destroyed? That was a good run. Maybe it'll be explained. A true running girl's way to start vacation. <laughs> I wonder how far I ran. I always lose track, of, lose track of where I'm going once the runner's high kicks in. Where did I go? Where did I come from? Paleo Joe? Pa Paleolithic Pale homing instinct. I'm sorry, I don't know rocks. <laughs> the sun's setting. I'd rather not sleep outside. You sleep in a cave. What is the difference? Who is, who that? is that? No, who is that? His face. I don't know you. Where'd you come from? A sparrow stands next to me. What? Her wing is resting on a motor scooter. She's got a motor scooter. It sounds it's like they're girl. actually human sized. Does it not? They might, they might be. I don't know. Looks a little bit vintage. How cute. Run away from here. You must be good. It's about a two hour drive. Wow. Oh my god. I run a lot. Wow. I guess that's why my legs hurt. Wow. Way to figure that out. Okay. I wonder if I'll be able to run home again. He has a scooter. Just hop on the back. That's her. It's a she sparrow. She hop on the back of hers. Deserves a ride home. Come the on. The intimidating sparrow gestures at her scooter. It's a little small, but we should fit. A mini bird scooter! Toshiba Azami. I sell ta Taki. I don't know what it was. I just skipped it. Yeah, thank you again, Azami. Let's see the, are we seeing the per people version? Oh, no, we don't get to see the people version of Because no, you can't date a girl. Azami. We're not oh, so their physical appearance doesn't matter because I can't date them. You're a very cautious driver. Carving into your soul, kid. One accident is all it would take. That would be the end of both our lives. This, this is very true. Face! Safety I just first. love, like, the looking. The I, way know. I mean, I, at this point, I think running would have been the better option. Probably. Still a long time until the semester starts, and I still have a lot of homework. Maybe I should apply for a part time job. Ooh! Are you going to do your homework or get a job? Get a job or forget it. Forget I feel like... I just like saying forget about it. <laughs> I think getting a job would be more interesting. True. I saw a flyer at the station hiring school students over the summer. Maybe I'll meet someone new. Maybe. There's a bird on the desk. It's beautiful in here. Yeah. There's oh, birds everywhere. Boy. Ooh. Who is Party that? Miss. We're not open yet. Oh, If you could come back at noon. Here to ask about the job. Carpeteer of the calf is extremely a elegant. That's a parakeet. A true gentle bird, without a doubt. Oh, it is a boy. Okay, so I might get a person. This must be what it. This must be what people mean when they refer to mature attractiveness. Oh, mm. he's an attractive bird. We're gonna call him Uru. <laughs> Uru. Oh no, Kenza, because that's that name is there. Ken. The owner of the. To Ken. Yeah, Ken. I'm the order owner of the Torimi Cafe. I'm G. Shelby. Welcome, Miss Shelby. You want to interview me? Wonderful lady. Oh, he's just giving you the job. Just moving boxes of coffee and tea about. Okay, I could do that. Ooh, I want to know what it looks like. It's a person. It matters. I, I feel like it will, because if it did it for the school doctor, is he going to do it for him? Tomorrow, then. Do we get Show it? him. Why is he not doing the portrait? I want to know what he looks like. You turn them on, right? Yeah, they're on. Today's okay. my first day working at Mr. Urashiha. I guess I just can't be paired with him, maybe. Good morning, sir. Let me start by showing you where everything is. I'm sure you'll be able to remember everything soon, so please ask if you can't find something. No problem. <laughs> Shows me around the cafe, explaining everything inside. The shop is small and it keeps everything very tidy, so I'll be able to remember it. It's far too plain for a young lady such as yourself. Compared to my house. He doesn't care. Is that Ryuta? Oh, it is. So the flyer. Oh, oh I already got the what? job, Ryuta. Tough. Um, um. Could you use two people? No. Oh, Tough no. Tough luck. No. Is he not going to get... I'm not going to give the job to Ryuta because Ryuta mentioned he already has a job. Actually, yeah, he did. So... So I'm going to do the job I was hired for, 
and Ryuta can go to his other job. Oh, I feel bad, though. Too bad. Clearly, I need money, though, if I don't have a home. Yeah. I really want to do this. Don't worry about so it. I've got a couple more places. All right, and he already has a job. No, he's totally cool. May have just ruined my chances of marrying him, but that's fine. No, oh, you guys are going to fall hella in love and have mad chicklets. <laughs> mad chicklets. I wonder who the first customer of my life will be. Wow! Is that who I think it is? Who is it? Do you know? It's, you just said you didn't I, get this far. I think First customer of my life, a young man doesn't quite suit. Rabu. Oh. His name's going to be Rabu. I was hoping for somebody who'd raise a few more flags, maybe a white peacock. No! <laughs> no! Would you like a bath or a meal? Oh, that's what this place is. They get baths. Oh. Perfect delayed reaction. What? Well, oh, hello, hello, Rabu. Called it! Ah, it is! Do I get a people picture of him? I believe you do, Nana. Oh, why? Am I just stuck with the people at well, school? All right. Well, that's okay. And it's only the main characters get people portraits. Okay, so they're not main characters. Oh, and I, no. I, yeah, because I could have not taken the job. This is true. All right, but he's a pretty bird. <laughs> he is. What was he? I already forgot. <laughs> but it's yellow. Bug he's a bugger. <laughs> Wanted to provoke that reaction of someone. Okay. Thank you, Mr. Rob, who thinks to you my dream has come true and I can die happy. Wait, what just happened? Well, that's how it is. Shelby, right? That seat there is my private property. I'll remember that now. Y'all, he's southern. In Japan. <laughs> a southern a new Japanese encounter bird. in the little birdie cage. Today he's is a good day. I shall make some coffee to celebrate. Please sit down, both of you. I think you're just sharing coffee with the uh, normal Here guy. Go. Here, this city looks beautiful. I don't know what was up with that other one. Stayed out in town for too long and it's late. On my own, of course. Riding the stormy waves of life alone is what we humans are all about. <gasps> this is depressing. Hey, human. Whoa! Oh, no. <laughs> oh, no, no. St. Pigeon Nation. I bet a rich, rich girl, girl like you, you gets a lot of pocket money from daddy, huh? I don't think Punk I have a dad. Agent. Look. Rich little girl going to a fancy school thinks she's so great. Um, no. I don't have home. <laughs> they wearing little sunglasses. <laughs> I can't tell them apart. I can pick Ryuta out of a crowd. <laughs> but rock doves have met all look the same. Wow. <laughs> Do you have some business with me? If not, go away. Hey, that's not nice. Show us some cash first. Cash. No. They buff up their Dumb chest. Dumb punks. I imagine you could just kick on them. Are they? I feel like maybe these are people-sized birds. I don't know anymore. I can't tell. What? What? You little. They're angry now. My gather... hunter-gatherer instincts can feel a fight coming. Three pigeons on my own. Can I win this? In reality... Totally. Slam. Thud. Am I alive? The ground. Some birdie flips forward in the blink of an eye. The doves are knocked to the ground, twittering in surprise. Looming majestically over the fallen doves. <laughs> <It's> zombie! <laughs> zombie, the safety. That was close, Shelby. Are you sure you should be out this late? Clearly not! No! Me! Well, I'm passing Takoyaki Lady. Takoyaki, that's what it was. Oh, I like Takoyaki. It's actually pretty good. They're stubborn. Here they come. We can take them now. We're not going to take We're this from a finch and a human. Yeah! That was me. Not done. Teach you Teach. chicks a lesson. Your sparrow kick is super cool, Azami. Don't relax just yet. There's a real fight. Oh, God. Magnificent. Fluttering. Under the glow. I just imagine the wings fluttering as they, like, bounce at each other. <laughs> totally kicked their butt. They're birdie butts. All right. We're going to stop there. Leave a like if you want to see a part four. Maybe we'll just finish this all up because I'm genuinely interested in it now. Leave a like okay. if you enjoyed, and we'll see you next time. Bye. Uh, bye.